Hey, hey. One of the questions I get asked the most is, Colin, how do I make ChatGPT sound like me? The responses always come out vanilla, robotic, and very obvious. As somebody who has used ChatGPT extensively for more hours than I care to remember, I am really adept now at seeing ChatGPT's language. So I can spot a Facebook ad, beep, 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 beep. I'm better than those AI detectors. I can see ChatGPT's language a mile away and uh, it makes me smile every time. It's like, whoa, hang on. Like trust just falls through the floor because I know that you've just written this in ChatGPT. And there is a way to be more nuanced and be more clever and more intelligent about crafting stuff that actually sounds like you. It's like ChatGPT climbs inside of your head and produces content that you have. It's like it comes from your soul. It's hard to describe it. So it's really actually su super simple and I'm going to share it with you right now. Okay, let's dive in. There we go. There is a function called custom instructions and it has two sections to it. The first is what would you like ChatGPT to know about you? And the second is is how would you like ChatGPT to respond? Now, I'm going to play with some different ways to do this, and I'm going to show you it in a second. But essentially, I'm going to show you what I have in mind. So I have a descriptive piece of text that tells ChatGPT who I am, what I do, how I do it, how I my, my values, my ethos, and all of the things that, that make me me, right? And give ChatGPT that information that it just doesn't know until we tell it. So previously, I would have this stuff in a copy and paste format to start off conversations. With custom instructions turned on, you don't need that anymore. You can just have them automatically apply to every future conversation. And then the second part is, how do you like ChatGPT to respond? This is where it gets really interesting, and this is where we're going to have a bit of fun. So these words are the words that you can use to spot ChatGPT a mile off, ChatGPT text. The words delve, unlock, revolutionize, craft, akin, game changer is another one. So these are words and phrases that when you see our alarm bells go off to know this is perhaps not generated by a human, right? People skilled in wordsmithing, they get to see and they're, they're able to notice the difference. When you use these things, that difference becomes much, much closer. And the, sh the shift, the change you need to make to the content is so much smaller as well. So let's dive into chat and have a little look at this in action. I'm going to take my, in the, firstly, three dots bottom left, custom instructions is where you go to set this. And you can see I've got mine in here. So that if I ask ChatGPT a question, it's going to reply based on this information. You can see here, it gives you some thought starters for what to put in here, where you are, what you do, what your hobbies are, what subjects you talk about, and what are some goals you have. So that gives a bit of background information that ChatGPT can draw on to give it some context about you and your the lens through which you see the world. And then the second is how you want it to start to respond. This is where we can dictate the language formality, the level of casual language that is used, all of these things, right? So I'm going to take these out for a moment and I'm going to say, uh, address me as Colin and speak as though you, you are a motivational speaker. Okay. So watch this now. I'm going to start a new chat. I'm just going to go into the default GPT-4 and I'm going to say, uh, why does my why matter in business? Now watch the response. Beautiful. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into custom instructions and I'm going to remove this now. And I'm going to turn it off and I'm going to hit save. I'm going to take the same prompt and I'm going to start a new chat. But now it's not got our custom instructions. So I'm just going to say, why does my why matter to clients? And what's the difference in the response? Oh, 
Okay, can you see the difference? So in this one, it's uh, it's a very matter of fact, very logical. Here's ten reasons why your why is important, why it matters to clients, which is great. But it doesn't speak to my soul, right? And if we look at this one, all I did is ask it to act, act like a motivational speaker, and the difference in the response. Colin, you have within you the power to inspire, to motivate, and to change lives. Embrace your why. Let it shine brightly and watch as it not only elevates your business, but also attracts clients who believe in your mission as much as you do. Remember, it's not about what you do. It's about why you do it. Stand tall. Let your purpose be your guide. And success will surely follow. Woo! My heart's on fire reading that, right? So now, all of a sudden, we've taken some very vanilla language out of ChatGPT, and we've already got something that's quite inspirational. And I speak like this. So this is how I how I roll. I'm very driven by energy and, and the emotion of what I'm saying. So being able to bring this in to chat's responses is massive. It's so powerful. It doesn't stop there. So we can go back into custom instructions and we can say, hey, let me do this. Respond in a French accent. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> So can you see the power of using custom instructions to make chat play and sound just like you? This is, we're just having a bit of fun here, but this is where you can really go go crazy here in giving it instructions and sharing things. So I, I love to uh, draw parallels and references to philosophy, spiritual texts. I do it all the time. I'm, I'm always reading. I'm always picking things up and quotes just kind of live inside of my brain, right? So introducing that into the custom instructions takes the whole response to another level and now instead of getting something out of chat gpt like we started with this very robotic it's i mean it's good it's 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 actually okay right this is good good content but if we are looking to spark creativity to get something that we can use as a starting point for our own content it just this isn't me. This doesn't sound like me. And just by playing with those custom instructions, you can make chat all of a sudden sound like you. It is so powerful. Go and have a play with it. Let me know how you get on and I'll see you next time.